Hi guys, this is George back here with another vlog and today we are here at Hyde Park Winter Wonderland. We're starting off on Ice Mountain. I haven't ridden this since 2018 so I'm looking forward to getting back on it. Here we go. Spinning already, and up we go. Here we go. We're spinning right from the start as well. That's something you don't always get on these Ravishon spinners. Way! Oh, here we go. We're getting a good spin. Yeah! Here we go. Ready for the drop. Way! Good air time there. Here we go, we've got a big drop now. Whee! Air time! Here we go, more spinning. Whee! Oh my gosh, this is a good spin! penguins down there. This is quite a well-themed ride. Whee! Ready for some air time. There we go, and into the brakes. Oh, it's a good ride, that. Oh, sharp brakes. There we go, it was good, that. So here's one of the new rides for this year at Winter Wonderland. This is Aeronaut, an 80 meter tall star flyer. This is the world's tallest transportable star flyer. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go on this next actually since it's right here. Let's go for a ride on here. It's very impressive. Here we go guys, it's time for a ride on Aeronaut. Don't swing please, don't swing. Eight pound per ride, so it's not cheap but this is a very big ride. Here we go. Oh wow, it's already high. So yeah, this is 80 meters tall and it's very windy. Oh wow, look at the view. Here we go. We're getting closer to the top now, it's quite intense. Oh, it's very cold up here though. Sorry about the wind noises on the camera. Here we go, we're at the top now. Oh, it's so windy. Beautiful views across the event. It was very impressive. Oh, it's great to be back here. over there oh my gosh that was a short cycle we're going down already that was a very short cycle i've just paid eight quid for this oh we're speeding up again Whee. oh my god everything looks so small down there For a travelling ride, it looks really nice. Oh, it's so cold up here though. My hands are freezing and I've not bought gloves. Here we go, we're going down, Nega. We're going down. That's the end of the cycle. Still quite a short cycle for £8, but it's a good ride. Some great views over the event and London as well in general. Fantastic. It's a good ride. I enjoyed that. I probably won't do it again though.
If it was cheaper, I definitely would. There we go. One of the tallest rides at the event this year is Aeronaut. That was a good ride on Aeronaut there, the world's tallest transportable star flyer. Quite a short cycle for the price you pay. It is eight pound per ride, so it is expensive. However, it does look great off ride and the views from the top are absolutely incredible. As you can see behind me there, we've got Airborne over there, one of my favorite rides to ever show up at this event. I can't wait to get back on there later. It was new for last year and it has returned this year. So yeah, I'm very excited to get back on that. But yeah, Aeronaut, it's a good ride. If it was cheaper, I would go on it again, but because of the price, I won't be doing it again. Probably this year. It's probably a one and done ride. As I was saying when I was on there as well about the theming of this ride, look at the entrance for it here. It's absolutely fantastic. And then you've got the exit just there. And the tower itself looks really nice as well. Of course, it's got a steampunk theme, if you haven't already guessed. But yeah, it looks really good off-ride. Here we go then guys, time for the APRA Ski Party Fun House. Thank you. Here we go, so I did this fun house last year and it was really good. I think it was one of the new ones last year. Here we go. It's quite a long one from what I remember. Oh. Oh, here we go. Oh gosh, there was a step there, I didn't even realize. Hey, here we go. Oh, we got these weird stairs now. Okay. <coughs> Let's see how well I can do on these while vlogging. Here we go. Oh, looks like we've got a bit of a car wash going on in there. <laughs> here we go. Let's go. Oh my gosh, this is very difficult trying to do with one hand. There we go. Oh, we got loads of effects coming up here. Wait. Yeah, oh, we got some nice views over the event here. And this is only the first floor as well. We're still going up higher. Wait, oh my gosh, these are weird. Here we go, we've got a conveyor about here now. It's like we're in the supermarket. Lovely views over there. City star. And then we got the Munich looping there as well. Can't wait to get back on that very iconic coaster. The world's largest transportable coaster. Here we go, that's the end of the conveyor. Fresh delivery. Whee. Here we go, do these move? Oh, they do move. Oh, these are quite weird. Oh, they're quite slippery as well. Here we go. Way. <laughs> oh, are these, these, oh, are these lights up when you step on them? Except that one, which is already on, apparently. Here we go. Oh, spinning round in here now. Way. Up we go. We're going even higher. Oh my gosh, we're going higher. Oh no, are we going higher? Oh no, that's where we go down. We are going to go up another floor though. We've got more of these things here. Oh, look at the views over there. There's Aeronaut. We've got a slingshot over there as well. Wild Mass XXL. Just XXL there as well. Gladiator. Loads of rides I can't wait to get back on. We got one of the new ones over there as well, Discovery. I probably won't be doing that today because I've not been feeling too great recently. So I'm not gonna go too hardcore on the rides. I'm, I'm just recovering from COVID. So I'm not gonna take it too hardcore in terms of rides today. However, I will probably be coming back here and we'll do another vlog. So if there's rides I don't go on today, then I'll go on them next time. Airborne looks absolutely brilliant there. Whee! Oh my gosh, we're spinning the other way now. Oh, we got more of these. Whee! Oh, 
Oh, bit of a tight squeeze there. Oh my gosh, are these gonna... Oh, we're all right, they don't move very much. Up we go. Nice views into the Bavarian village there. I'll probably go for a walk around there later. And there's Dr. Archibald as well. It's great to see that back. That hasn't been here for a couple of years. Of course, the event was canceled in 2020. And then in 2021, it wasn't here. Whee. These are quite difficult to walk over. Here we go. Let's see if we can get a full slide on this one. Get to the end. Oh my God, I keep sliding on the other one. Whee. There we go. Oh, we can get some views here as well. Nice views of the Bavarian village. Oh, I can't believe I just fell over. Here we go. We've got a slide coming up now as well. Thank you. Okay, let's go. I don't think I'm gonna fit down here. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's quite quick. <laughs> hey, there we go. Oh my gosh, this, we've got a little bit more as well. Here we go, through the car wash. Another conveyor. goes the Apres Ski Funhouse. It's a good one that. Be careful on those rolling things though. <laughs> I can't believe that. Oh that was funny. There we go. Brilliant Funhouse. Literally just up there. That's where I fell over. Oh fantastic. some more rides now and to be honest I don't even know what I want to do there's so many rides that I want to get on I don't know which one to start with so I'm just leaving the Bavarian village I think I'm gonna go and do Wild Mouse XXL I really want to get back on that I've only ridden it a couple of times I rode it last year and um, before that I hadn't ridden it since 2017 so I think I'm gonna go for a ride on there now I think it's quite expensive I believe it's seven pounds per uh, for an adult on this one or it might be eight now actually I feel like it might be eight I can't remember how much I paid last year but either Either way, I'm about to find out. And either way, it's going to be expensive. This is High Park Winter Wonderland. We're used to the expensive prices right now. Here we go. Oh, it's loud around here. Loads of different games. As you can see. Airborne right there. I think I'm going to save this one for a bit later until it starts to get a bit darker. We've got Hangover over there as well. I've got to give that a go. The amount of times I've come to this event and said that I'm going to go on that and then I don't make time for it. This year, it is a must-do at this event. But I think I'm going to go and do Wild Mass XXL now and then I might go and do Hangover after that. I've got Dr. Archibald over here as well, so I'll definitely do that as well. There's so many rides here at this year's event. It's just such a shame that one ride in particular didn't show up at this year's event that was supposed to, and that is Holland Blitz. So 
So basically, if you don't know, Holland Blitz is an indoor spinning coaster that was supposed to be showing up for this year's event. However, unfortunately, there was a last minute decision. Uh, I'm not sure why, but it's not come this year, which is a shame. I was looking forward to getting on it. It's a very iconic traveling roller coaster with really cool lighting effects. And it's a shame that it's not come. But we have still got loads of other rides to get on. And we have got Ice Mountain at least as well. But let's go for a ride on Wild Mars XXL. So I've just got my ticket for Wild Mars XXL. And the good thing with this ride is not only are you getting the coaster, you're getting a fun house in the queue as well. So here we go. It's just started raining a little bit as well, so hopefully that will stop soon. I did check the weather forecast before coming and it said it wouldn't be raining, so that's a shame. Got some fountains there that aren't on. Here we go. Literally, last time I was here last year, I queued in all of this. The queue was absolutely nuts for this ride. I waited about an hour for it. It was crazy. And literally this time, I'm walking straight through. There we go. I've been back in the Atmos ski party house, except these ones don't move as much. There we go. Hopefully I'm not going to fall over again. Some of these wobble, oh yeah, that's one of the wobbly ones, right. Let's stay away from that one. There we go. Oh, the man in here. oh my gosh. We don't need any more wind, it's cold enough. Here we go, this is quite weird. Broken effects here. Here we go. Let's get on the ride. Wild Mass XXL. And off we go on Wild Mass XXL. I'm not normally too keen on these Wild Mass coasters. However, this one is a really good one. Here we go. We're starting off with a big drop here. Whoa. There's not many trims on this one either, so that's good. But the corners are very smooth. Oh my gosh, that was some good airtime. Oh my gosh, these corners. Quite smooth though, luckily, but they are very whippy. Whee! Here we go. Whee! Oh my gosh! That was some good air time. Whee! Oh my god! So there we go, I just did Wild Mass XXL and I'm not sure how much you saw in the footage there because I was getting thrown absolutely all over the place. That was absolutely insane. I don't even really know how to describe that because it's very smooth but those corners are so whippy. There's barely any trims on there, and to be honest, I feel like it could actually do with some. Because those corners were crazy, like I was flying up out of my seat, and the restraints really loose on there. I actually wasn't that far from flying out on there, that was crazy. The airtime was insane on there as well. That was absolutely nuts. That was the most nuts ride I've ever had in a while, man. And to be honest, I'm not 100% sure if I enjoyed that. There's parts of me that did enjoy it. 
but that part of me that didn't really because I mean I, I nearly I nearly flew out of that thing I wasn't far off to be honest I was getting thrown out of my seat but there we go it, it was good fun it was good fun I didn't bang my knee on it a bit though so that, that wasn't very fun I'm now trying to get to a new coaster here at this year's event. It's a new credit for me to get. It's a Revachon Spinning Mouse. However, it's one of the new generation ones. So, hopefully I'll find that in a minute. It's literally next to Wild Mouse XXL. I think this is the way you get to it. So let's go and have a look. It's time for a ride on Time Machine. So here it is, Time Machine. As you can see, it's got an overbank there, which is what one of these new generation uh, Revachon spinners have. There was one of these here last year that had a launched lift hill. Oh, I don't think it was launched. It, I, I'm pretty sure it wasn't. It was just a lot faster than this one. It was like a launch, and that was Heidi Coaster. That one's not here for this year, and we've got this one instead. As I said earlier, it's a shame we didn't get Holland Blitz. This, I believe, wasn't advertised to come here when Holland Blitz was, so I believe or oh, I'd assume this was a last minute replacement for Holland Blitz. But here we go, let's go for a ride. So then guys, I'm not 100% sure what happened with this POV, however, I'm assuming that the GoPro was on when I didn't realise it, and then I thought I was turning the GoPro on, however, I accidentally turned it off without realising it. This was on Time Machine Coaster, so I don't have a POV for this coaster. However, I'll hopefully get back on it next time I go there and try and get a POV. It's a bit annoying that it happened on this ride because out of all the rides I did that day that's probably the one I was least likely to do again because it's just a revish on spinner but maybe I'll go on it again next time I'm there and get an on-ride POV for you in that vlog. Straight in now then to the police department fun house. Thank you. Brand new fun house for this year and it's the world's largest transportable fun house and it's absolutely huge! What's going on here? It is raining a little bit, however, it has made these quite slippery. Whee. Hopefully I'm not going to come flying in this one like I did the other one. Oh, look at this, this looks trippy. Way into the car wash. There we go. Nice, no, no spinning on that. Way. So yeah. Oh, here we go. Got a this fun house is absolutely huge. Literally, the size of it is incredible. I think we're going to be in here for a while. And of course, uh, the Alpen Hotel was an amazing fun house that used to come here to the event. However, that doesn't come anymore because I believe that's in a permanent location now. Oh my God, we've even got a show scene in here. Look at this. It's like we're in a courtroom. Oh, this is brilliant. Here we go into the tunnel. Mind your head in here. There we are. This is the key to the stairs now. I hope it's not. Oh, look at this. We've got some, some of the inmates here. There we go. Is he on the toilet? Yep, he's on the toilet. Got another one there. This is a service here. There we go. I think we're waiting for the stairs now. This is brilliant in here. There we go. Enjoy your poo, mate. Here we go then, up these stairs again. Difficult to do while only using one hand and also filming. There we go. More of these spinning things. Hey. Oh, what's going on here? Whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs> here we go. What else are we going to encounter around here? Whee! Oh, this is quite fast. Brilliant views of Time Machine there. Let's not 
up by falling over again. <laughs> I can't believe I fell over that other one. That was hilarious. Oh, look at this. Oh no, we've all been arrested. <laughs> This is very well. This is cool. This is a really well being fun house. I love this. Oh, wait, have we got two ways we can go? Oh, which way do we go? Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Whoa. Oh, this is amazing in here. I feel like I'm missing out on the view, though. I might have to come around here again, to be honest. Maybe I'll come around here again next time I come here. Here we go, I assume, oh yeah, there you go, so if you went the balcony way, then this is where you come back in. Look at the view over there, brilliant. Oh, this is, this is, these are weird, these are, these can be quite difficult to get through, especially when you've got a rucksack on, and I just so happen to have quite a big rucksack on, so we're going to see how this goes. We've got another level to go up after this as well. Here we go. Oh, here we go. Yeah, this is uh, quite tight in here. Oh, I think I'm going to get a bit stuck in here. Oh, there we go. Oh, this wasn't so difficult. He says, this bit looks a bit more hard here. There we go. Successfully done. Here we go, up the next set of stairs now. Oh my gosh, we've got more up here. This fun house is absolutely massive. I can't even imagine to think how much of this vlog is gonna be taken up by this fun house. Here we go, let's go a bit further ahead. Here we go. Oh, we've got some smoke effects in here. Does this spin? No. We've got another conveyor here. Whee. Brilliant views there at the event. Here we go. I think we're in a little bit of a queue here, so I'll speak to you once I get to the front. Here we go. We've got one of these tilting floors now. Oh my gosh, I can't even move. There we go. Oh. Oh, everyone's falling over. It appears I'm not the only one. Here we go. Oh gosh. Right, let's go. There we go. Oh, well, we're going to the prison now, apparently. Oh, more rollers. Let's try not to fall over. No, please don't spin. Here we go, we're going up another level now. Three. Let's go up. Brilliant views over there. Here we go, we're at the back now. Where are we going? We're about to find out. I think we're on the top floor now. Oh, we've got a slide. Oh, are we not going to the slide yet? Oh my gosh, we're going. Oh yeah, we, we, we're, we're about to do the slide. We need to go all over here first though. Watch out. If only it said that on the other one. You know what, I might actually hold on. <laughs> The views from the top of this fun house are absolutely amazing. Look at the lighting package on the Munich looping there and City Star as well. That is brilliant. Here we go. A 
slingshot over there as well. And here we go, it's time to keep the slide now. Here we go then, time for the slide now. It's quite squashed up in here. Oh my gosh, I'm stuck, I can't even get down. There we go. Oh no, this slide's terrible. I'm literally just scra- Oh, there we go, we're getting some speed. Oh, and we're stopping. Uh. On the floor, there we go. Here we go, we've got some more effects here now. What's that way? Oh, that's just where you go if um, you don't want to come down the slide. So yeah, there are stairs if you don't want to come down the slide, which to be honest, I'd recommend. That thing's terrible. Oh no, we've got some squirters here. Do you know what? I might hold this with my other hand so I can try and avoid in because that won't be very enjoyable or I can switch hands now I'm going to try and hold on because falling in here won't be very enjoyable we've got a jet ski there as well brilliant theming around this fun house oh my goodness what the hell is this Whee. right here we go let's not slide into the water Whee. This fun house has got some cool effects. I can't believe it's still going, to be honest. It's massive. All the lights are coming on now and it looks fantastic. Here we go. Is this one gonna lead? No, that one's not tilting. I don't think any of these ones tilt. Don't scrap me, you. That jet ski looks awesome. People are taking their time on this. There we go. On to the next one. Oh, that's the GoPro. Here we go. We've got more of these ones now. Oh my gosh, there's smoke effects. Whoa! I can't even see where the steps are now. Oh my god, this is brilliant. Where the, oh my gosh, I can't even see anything. This is nuts. Where the hell do we go? Let's try and wash some of the smoke out of the way. I don't even want to move now. Here we go. Oh, this fun house is Brilliant. This is nearly as good as the Alphen Hotel that used to be here. There we go, that's the end. That was absolutely fantastic. There we go, so I just did the police department's fun house and that was absolutely phenomenal. Second best traveling fun house I've ever done after the Alpen Hotel. That's the one that used to be here uh, before with uh, the madhouse section and there were loads of other scenes in there as well. There was a fake elevator section. That one was really good, but that was really good. Loads of smoke effects in there, lighting effects. There's loads of brilliant theming in there. That was brilliant. The world's largest traveling fun house and it's here at Winter Wonderland this year. Absolutely brilliant. So that was the final attraction of tonight's. We are going to be heading out now. I will most likely be returning here, hopefully a couple of times. Uh, there's loads more rides to get on at this year's event. Literally there is so much. Of course, Hangover right here. That's a ride I'll definitely be doing this year. 
airborne over there, one of my favourites ever at the event. And then the Munich looping there as well, which is my favourite ride that's ever shown up at the event, which is the world's largest travelling roller coaster. You've got uh, Gladiator over there as well. I haven't ridden that since 2017, actually, so I'd like to get back on that next time. But yeah, it's been absolutely amazing here. We've only been here for a couple of hours. The lights are looking absolutely fantastic. All starting to come on. We've got Snow Jet here as well. This ride's absolutely crazy. I did that a couple of years ago. Hopefully I'll do it again this year. Dr. Archibald as well. I need to do that one as well. That's got a new film for this year as well. So yeah, I'll definitely have to check that out at some point this year. But there we go. It's been an absolutely brilliant couple of hours here at Winter Wonderland. Now it's time to head out. And next time I'm here, I'll definitely stay while it's dark as well and get some night rides. So then guys, that is now the end of this vlog here. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure to follow me on Instagram at George Kelly. Follow me on Twitter at George Kelly. And check out my other YouTube channel at George Kelly. Thank you very much for watching. Stay safe everyone and I will see you all later. Bye.